In this video, we will discuss how to create free API keys for your business website. Let's see how. So firstly, you have to search in your browser Google console.cloud.com After your search, you will be directed to many pages. Select Google Cloud Platform. Then on your home, select dashboard. And then select create a project. Name your project. And if there is any organization name, you can add that too. Click create. Now, as you can see, there are many sidebars. Marketplace, billing, APIs and survey, support, admin, everything. So next you have to go to APIs and services. When you go to APIs and services, you can see project info, resources, APIs, Google Cloud Perform, status, error reporting, etc. You can also add people to the project by clicking on the project info's option, add people to this project. Now, go to APIs and Services Library and you can see the Maps options are the features available. Click View All 17 to view it all. These are the 17 maps available. Enable one by one. Now I am enabling Directions API. Like this, you can enable one by one. You can also see Manage option there. After enabling, you can manage it. There are many option features as you can see. Distance Matrix API, Geocoding API, Geolocation API, Maps Elevation, Maps Embed. You will be needing all these features. So enable one by one. Now go to Credentials. Because you don't want any other third party to use your API key. That is why this credential keys is, he, is here. You can see all your configuration here. You can set your consent screen as per your need. Now click on to create credentials. Then click API key. Your API key is being created. Now your API key is created. Save it for later. And if you want to keep some restrictions for your API key, you can go to your credentials and under application restrictions, you can choose the restriction either as none or as uh, for only http referrals that is for a website case and if it is web server uh, choose ip addresses uh, if it is using for android apps ios apps keep your restrictions for all that 
so it's your choice that has to keep restrictions or not you can also save your restrictions as a doc for later that is also optional now go to billing and uh, either you can link a new billing account or if you already have you can link that create a billing account bill your api key and start using.